Now, let's have set 2. Okay, set 2 po ng physics uh, drills blessings 2. What is the number of wave cycles for a given period of time called? Okay, number of wave cycles for a given period of time. Ang tawag po natin dyan is frequency. Okay, frequency. 28. A current of 0.5A exists in an 60 ohms lamp. The applied potential difference is what? Okay, ang hinahanap natin is potential difference. Now, anong formula po ang gagamitin natin? Ang formula po is V equals to IR. So, inputting everything, we have 0.5A times 60 ohms, which will yield to 30 volts, which is letter C, Charlie. 29. A step-up transformer has what? So, ang hinahanap natin is yung step-up transformer. Ano po ang ang mangyayari po kapag nagpro-process po si step up. Pag step up po, yung voltage po ang nag-i-increase. Meaning to say that the step up transformer has a description or yung pong input po niya or yung characteristics niya is that it has fewer windings on the primary coil. Pag fewer windings, yung secondary coil naman niya is marami. Meaning to say, nag-step up siya ng voltage. So, mas tumaas po yung capacity, capacity niya. Kasi, meron siyang fewer winding sa primary coil at saka, mas mataas po yung sa secondary coil. 30. If the index of refraction of crown glass is 1.5, what is the speed of light in crown glass? Okay, parang naulit na ito sa set 1. Ang sagot po natin dito is uh, 2 times 10 to the 8 meters per second, which is Charlie. 31. A fluorescent lamp rated at 100K kilowatts has an efficiency of 20%. How much energy is dissipate, dissipated as heat if the lamp is used for 5 hours? So, uh, from the up, from the, the question, yeah, try, let's try to analyze muna before answering. So, dito sa question, meron tayong lamp na uh, true rated po siya na 100 kilowatts. At meron siyang efficiency of 20%. Yan po yung work efficiency niya, hindi po yung heat efficiency. So, ano po ang energy na na-dissipate as heat po? Yung heat, heat energy niya, hindi po yung efficiency talaga na 20%. Na ginagamitan si lamp sa limang oras. So, paano po ito, sir? Ito lang po yon. So, meron tayong efficiency sa lamp which is 20%. Which means that meron siyang input energy na 20%. Kapag kinoconvert natin to light, yung remaining po niya is na dissipate siya as heat. So, power dissipated as heat, 80% of the 100 kilowatts, which is 80 kilowatts po. Energy dissipated naman as heat in fibers kasi ginamit natin siya, or giga, yung lap natin is ginagamit natin siya for 5 hours, yung uh, power times time is equivalent to 80 kilowatts times 5 hours. Therefore, the energy dissipated as heat is below yung 80 kilowatt natin nung power dissipated as heat times 5 hours which is 400 kilowatt hours so the answer is charlie 400 kilowatt hours 32 when analyzed with a spectrometer light from an incandescent source produces what okay kapag incandescent source po ang mapo-produce po diyan is a continuous one okay continuous one 33. A generalized mental image of an object is a ano po ang tawag dyan? Kapag generalized mental image, yan po yan. Yan po ay concept. Okay? Concept po. Hindi definition, hindi impression, at hindi naman mental picture. 34. A 1.2 kilowatts turbo broiler is operated for 45 minutes to cook a whole chicken. How many kilowatt hours of electrical energy is utilized in the process? So, ang ihinahanap natin is ilan po daw ang kilowatt hours na ang, ginaga, ang ginamit para makook po si whole chicken. So, paano po natin isolve ito? By using formula yung E at saka power times time. So, meron yung power which is 1.2 kilowatts times 0.75 hours kasi naman 45 minutes. So, 45 divided by 60 minutes kasi Yung unit natin is dapat hours para kilowatt hours. So, manipulating, we will end up with 0.9 kilowatt hours, which is bravo. 35. The boiling point of helium, one of the noble gases, is negative 269.0 degrees Celsius, 
which of the following is its equivalent in the Kelvin scale? So, di ba, yung Kelvin natin is 273. So, negative 269 plus 273, we will end up to 4 Kelvin. Okay? 4 Kelvin. 36. What temperature reading in Fahrenheit is equivalent to 78 degrees Celsius? Okay? 78 degrees Celsius by using the formula. Okay, hindi ko na ibibigay ito sa inyo kasi basic lang po ito. Pag 78 degrees Celsius, try nyo lang po isolve ito at home or ngayon po kapag nag-binge uh, watch kayo dito, yung so 78 Celsius is 172 po. Yan po yung Fahrenheit scale po, 78 degrees Celsius. 37. A hot water bottle containing 1,000 grams of water cools from 60 degrees Celsius to 15 degrees Celsius. The heat given off by the water is what? So, ang hinahanap natin is yung Q. Yung Q natin formula is MC delta T. Okay? So, MC delta T, 1,000 grams times yung sa um, constant po na sa water, which is 1 cal per gram Celsius, at saka yung delta T, yung change in time, which is 60 minus 15, which is 45. And we will end up with 45,000 calories. 38. What thermodynamic process is involved in a closed car inside a hot garage? Okay, now, meron tayong uh, tatlong thermodynamic process. Meron tayong isochoric, isobaric, at saka isothermal. Now, From this question, it is only ang involved lang po dito is ang closed car. Meaning to say, it has a constant volume. Kapag constant volume, ay sasagot natin is isochoric. Okay? Isochoric. 39. As more heat is added to a sample of water boiling in a stove, its temperature is what? Okay? Water boiling. So, the more, uh, the more heat that you add, it will just remain the same. Okay, kasi yung boiling point is plakado po siya na 100 degrees Celsius. Hindi na yan magagawa na magiging 101. Okay? It will remain the same. 40. During the student technologies and entrepreneurs of the Philippines, uh, competition po siya in landscaping, a water pump transformer changes to 16 volts uh, across the primary to 12 volts across the secondary. If the secondary coil has 10 turns, how many turns does the primary coil have? So, ilang turns po ito? Anong formula po ang naang gagamitin natin, sir? Ito lang po yon. So, Vs over Vp equals to Ns over Np. Yan po yung number of coils po. Okay. Number of coils secondary, number of coils primary, voltage secondary, at saka voltage primary. So, ang hinahanap natin dito is number of turns po sa primary coil, which is yung Np. So, Np is equivalent to 2. 116 volts times 10 turns divided by 12 volts and we will have 180 turns. Okay, 180 turns. 41. Knowing that the distance of the Earth from the Sun is about 148,800,000 kilometers. And the speed of light, how long does it take light to reach us? Okay, ano po ang gagawin natin dito? So, we will just calculate the speed of light here. So, in calculating, we will have V is equal to distance over time, which is yung time natin is yung 148,800,000. Alright? So, we will have, or it will yield to 496 seconds, which will convert to minutes, magiging 8.27 minutes. So, approximately 8 minutes po. Okay? Approximately 8 minutes. 42. How much current is amperes flows through a 100 watts bulb that is connected across 220 volts? So, paano po ang formula nito? Ang formula lang gagamitin natin is P equals to IV. And we are, we need to find the current, which is yung I. So, paano yan? 100 watts divided by 220. So, we will have, it will yield to 0.455, okay? 0.45, 0.455 current, okay? In Amperes. 43. Which two waves lie at the ends of the visible spectrum? Okay? Yung hinahanap natin is at the ends of the visible spectrum. Hindi po sa whole electromagnetic spectrum. So, ang isasagot po natin kapag ends of the visible spectrum, infrared at ultraviolet rays. Infrared at saka ultraviolet rays. 44. A certain radio station broadcast at a frequency of 675 kHz. What is the wavelength of the radio wave? Now, 
how to solve the wavelength. Ano po ang formula na gagamitin natin? Ito lang po yon. Wavelength is equivalent to V over F. So, equals to 3 times 10 to the 8. Yan po yung speed of light at watt vacuum over 675 times 10 to 10 cube hertz. Okay, kasi kilohertz po. So, manipulating, we will end up with 444 meters. 45. An electric appliance consumed 1.5 kilowatt hours when continuously operated in 2 hours. What is the wattage of this appliance? So, ang hinahanap natin is ilan po daw ang wattage po sa appliance. What formula do we need to use? We will just need yung E equals to power times time. So, hinahanap natin is yung power, yung wattage, so equals to 1.5 kilowatt hours over 2 hours. Kasi ini-operate po natin siya in 2 hours. Then, we will have 750 watts po. Yan po yung wattage po sa ni appliance. For 6. A generator is a device that converts, okay, uh, nasa set 1 po ito, converts mechanical to electrical energy. For 7. What is a model? Okay, ano po ang isang model? Ang model po is a physical copy, it is a sketch, at, it, at saka it is an interpretation of a theory. So, all of the above are models. For 8. What will be your charge if you scrape electrons from your feet while scuffing across the rug? So, ano po ang charge po natin dyan? Ang charge po natin is positive po. Okay, positive. Yung rug po is yung negative. For 9, which statements is correct about the law of conservation of energy? Okay, saan po dito ang nag-talk about law of conservation of energy? From the options, isa lang po yung sagot. Ang sagot po natin is letter D. The total amount of the energy is constant. Kasi energy cannot be created nor destroyed. So, meaning to say, energy is constant all the way. 50, last number. A 300 watts at 220 volts TV is used at an average of 4 hours a day for 30 days. If the electrical energy cost 1.60 per kilowatt hour, how much is the energy cost? So, we need to calculate po everything. So, ano po ang gagamitan natin ng formula? Ito lang po yun. Power times time again. Okay? 300 watts times 30 days times 4 hours, we will have 36,000 watt hours. Or, uh, Convert, convert natin to kilowatt hours, magiging 36 kilowatt hours po siya. 36 kilowatt hours, then, i-multiply natin siya to 1.60. Then, we will have 57.60 pesos. Okay? So, that's all for set 2. Kita-kits po sa set 3 on the next video.